Shalom. All praises be your house, Bashan, your house, Shai. Double honors to the apostles, the elders of GMS who rule well, and peace and blessings to the elect. This is GMS Arkansas. Stop and listen. Uh, I'm going to read the scripture out of Revelations 1 and 3, which is one of, uh, one of my favorite scriptures of many. This is a favorite one, too. It says, Blessed is he that read it, and they that hear the words of this prophecy, and keep those things which are written therein, for the time is at hand. It says, Blessed is he that read it, and, and they that hear the words of this prophecy, and keep those things which are written therein, for the time is at hand. So that scripture is saying, uh, let favor be shown. It says blessed. It means uh, let favor be shown to him that read it. Uh, that man that read it is fortunate. He'll be well off if, if you read the scriptures. That read it. Uh, that acknowledge these words in his book. It says, and they that hear the words, that consider, that take heed, because Israel don't consider, man. They they have no clue. I'll tell you that Isaiah one and three. They don't even consider. You know. So it says it's favor the man who consider these words and acknowledge these words in his book, they'll be well off. Right? And it says that they hear the words of this prophecy, right? Prophecies are these predictions in the Bible because in the Bible it's predicted that a, a microchip is coming. It's predicting that thermonuclear destruction is coming. It's predicting that sedition among men is coming. It's predicting concentration camps. Those are predictions in this Bible. And those times are coming. But it says, well off is a man who acknowledge that and read it and know it. It says, and keep those things, right, which you maintain those things which are written therein. Right? The law, statutes, and commandments. If you take heed to what's written in this book and you maintain it, until the end, then you'll be well off, right? And you'll be fortunate that the Lord has saved you in the end. It says, and keep those things which are written therein, for the time is at hand. This particular season that is hand is coming. It's 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 uh the end game, man. It's imminent. When you look the word imminent up, I'm gonna look this word up. I got it right here. It's imminent. That is coming imminent in the etymology of 1520s from Middle French imminent, directly from Latin imminentum, overhanging, impending. It says past particle of imminary to overhang, to lean towards, hence to be near. Also threaten, menace, impend, to be at hand, be about to happen. So what's overhanging us? What overhangs America is thermonuclear destruction. This country is leaning towards going into uh, uh, thermonuclear destruction. It's leaning towards going into martial law. It's leaning into going into a famine. That's what it's lean, leaning towards, you know? It's threatened, they threaten thermonuclear destruction every day when these definitions that go right with it be about to happen because these things are about to happen. You know, they are about to happen. So it's imminent, it says, and keep those things which are written there and so we maintain those things that are written there for the time is at hand. So it's imminent that, that thermonuclear destruction is about to happen. It's a time and a season that is about to happen and, it's, and it says it's coming near when you look up imminent, to be near. And that's right around the corner. So favor and well off is that man who, who take heed to these words in this book and these prophecies, man. And you got to maintain it until the end. And the Lord have, might have mercy on you that he'll have you well off and fortunate that he'll save you, man. In these coming trying times, man, that are about to come to America. The bad times are coming, you know. And I uh, just wanted to share that scripture because that's a beautiful scripture right there, man. And I hope you I hope it was edifying to the brotherhood, man. With that, all praise be Yahweh, Hashem, Yahweh Shai. Double honors to the apostles, the elders, GMS, who rule well. Brock the thumb, peace and blessings to the elect. Shalom.